Hi, Dr. Benton here. A little health tip, Houdini of Healing, in the house. So I, uh, I'm working on my patient, and uh, he complains, uh, one of his complaints is knee pain, and I'm doing some muscle testing, and he indicated that whenever I was testing this leg, in particular I was actually having him push against my hand, it felt really weak. It felt weak to me, it felt weak and bothersome to him. So I am putting a little blood pressure cuff on his calf muscle and I'm testing both sides. And this is more of a nutritional deficiency test for calcium and magnesium. If, if he starts cramping in his muscle before we can get to 200 millimeters of mercury, then he's got a deficiency more, more often minerals like calcium and magnesium and then to a lesser extent some essential fatty acids. Mm -hmm. And so let's start pumping it up. And then you let me know if it feels like it's cramping or just feels tight. Well, it definitely feels tighter than the other one. Tighter than the other side. Cramping? Not cramping, but the cap is really, really tight. Okay. So it's tighter than the other side. Okay. We let the air out. So we, we was complaining about 160 mil. Mm -hmm millimeters of mercury um, so we can we'll check one thing I'm gonna put a, I'm gonna put some minerals trace minerals let me try a trace mineral okay so you're just gonna suck on that bad boy for me all right okay let me know it starts feeling really tight and crampy starting to get tight but not Ooh, there. Okay, so we got a little higher. We actually were able to get a 200 before he complained. So, so that's definitely an improvement of about 40 degrees because he was really complaining about 160. Mm -hmm. I was able to get to 200 before he said, "Ah, oh, that's too much." So that's one way to evaluate nutritional need, especially when if your muscles are cramping. Um, that's your tip for the day.